All right, this is how fast an idiot can beat Sonic Adventure. And guess what? An idiot can beat it very fast. But, oh no, Jeepers Creepers, we got Water Glob Zero. And he's pretty angry, but it's okay because he's pretty easy to defeat. And also, I'm very skilled. The title says I'm an idiot, but the only reason I put that is just in case I do bad. Which, um, Gilp, I might do. I might do really, really bad. But, you know, he gets on the poles. Uh, um, pretty sus chaos. That's so weird to get on the poles. He keeps punching at me, but I'm super fast, and I'm also Sonic, so I dodge it, and I beat him up. And then I emote on top of his lifeless body, which is pretty cray-cray. Then I do a little bit of a jig. Then I chillax by the pool. But we're going to skip the cutscenes, because Sonic's too cool for that. And also, I'm trying to see how fast I can beat this game. But I have to rescue Tails, because his little stupid self crashed his plane. Ugh. So, I do some pretty cool flips and tricks, because I'm Sonic. I go, whoo, and then I just speed across, and whoa, a big whale's coming after me. Ugh. Sharing my feet pits was not a good idea, but then I decided to run up the walls. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch out for Sonic. I think he's run up the walls, gang. Um, then I do this, and I go, whoa, then I go, broom, because that's what Sonic says. That's his hit catchphrase. Then I do this really cool trick, and then I save Tails, little silly old Tails. Then I email on top of him, because he's such a noob and he deserved it. Level C was completed, I can confirm, and we got an emblem. Then, stupid old Dr. Eggman tried to attack, and, um, that's not how we roll. So, I had to beat him up, for sure, for sure. But, he decided to launch missiles at me. What a weirdo. I think, um, he's got some issues to work out. But he charges at me like a little lunatic, but he, I swiftly defeated him. And then, he blew up. Kinda wild. Really wild. I'm also recording this in my closet. Oh yeah, he emotes on top of Eggman. But then I had to take this little funky stone, and I had to put it in a keyhole. And when I did that craziness, it took me to Windy Valley. And, well, I can't confirm. It was pretty windy. There was a tornado. Whoa, whoa, I literally said that. And then I was in the storm, like in Fortnite. So I had to, like, because I'm Sonic, I had to navigate through the uh, eye of the storm. So I'm just chilling, and then... Tails stole my rocket. I'm going to beat him up later. Actually, here's a clip of me beating him up right now. So then, um, yeah. I was super cool and super fast. And I did this loop. That was pretty crazy. So, yeah. I was so fast I even ran on air, as shown right now. Then we found the Chaos Emerald. Then I emoted again. And then Tails' big self is covering up the screen. But, again, I can confirm we got another emblem. Then, we hit the sewers. Man, we're in the trenches, for real. But, you know, through this hardship, um, well, if we can get there. I, I found some new shoes. They were pretty tight. Really tight. They were so not whack. They were so cool. And then this little ball started circling around me. Pretty weird. So I had to test out my new kicks. And I can confirm, chat, they are super fat. Ooh, why did I say chat? Ew, gross. So weird and wacky. But then, um, my adventures took me to this new piece of clothing. And I failed. Oh, uh, I can confirm I failed the first attempt. I know. But that's why this title is called How Fast an Idiot Can Be Sonic Adventure. A non-idiot would have got it without failing. So you knew what you were watching when you clicked on this video. But anyways, we got some... We got a bracelet. I don't know who wears bracelets. But... Anyways, we escaped the hotel. And then with our newfound drip, we're about to hit the casino. So... We did. And the casino... Well, it got pretty crazy. Just kidding. Casino Opolis is my least favorite Sonic level. So, I'm going to skip most of what happened in Casinoopolis. I'm just going to show how I totally ruled this uh, pinball machine. Watch this. Oop, failed. Ugh. 
but eventually we did make it to the end. And after I got my money up and not my funny up, they still took all my cash. That was pretty crazy. Did not like that. So, at least I got the Chaos Emerald after climbing up all of my money that I earned in the casino. But gambling's not cool, so don't do it. But we still got an emblem. Now, we took this little weird icy stone and put it in the keyhole, which got us to my, uh, like my third favorite level, Ice Cap Zone. Which is pretty cool. After we climb up this ladder. <laughs> That's also what Sonic says. Now we're in ice cap zone. Now what you're about to see is me. Ugh, struggling to get this skip. And it was so annoying. But eventually I got up there. But not on this attempt. It was actually this attempt. I just lied again. It wasn't that attempt. It's going to be the next attempt. I also lied on this one. It's going to be the next one. I also lied that time. It's going to be on this one. Like I said on that one. And then, like, after struggling to do that skip, I was like, dang, I really got to clutch this next skip. So, I put on my big boy pants, and I said, let's do this thing. So then, I did this super cool skip. Like that. And then, it was, like, it was so crazy. Because I kept doing the level awesomely. Because Ice Cap Zone is such a fun level. Then I hopped off the walls. Because I'm just a party animal like that. And my partying got so hardying that this icicle fell. And then the bridge fell. And then all this, all this snow fell. And I was like, ah! And then I was like, oh man, I got to shred some snow. I was like, I was all, I was snowboarding all the way down the hill. It was super crazy. But... My rad skills got me away from this avalanche. Oops, did I just spoil the ending? Oh my goodness. But yeah, I'm just that awesome, so. Um, but it kept approaching even closer and closer and closer. But then I hit that awesome ramp thing and it shot me out of the way. But then I kept running into icicle birds. But it's okay, because I was able to maneuver away from them, as shown in this footage. And you're probably going, but, but what else could he have done? What awesome things is he going to do next? Well, I'll show you right now. I'm about to do a flip. Wahoo! That's exactly what I said. So, you're probably going, I bet he's not going to do another flip. I bet he's not going to hit this next one. And to that, I say, I didn't. I failed. It's okay. We all make mistakes. But then the ops pulled up, and I was like, oh, shoot. I got to show them what I'm made of. So I flipped all over them. And my awesome skills made them so angry that they, 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 they started, like, griefing. And then they and then they tried to bomb me. But, like, they're just salty because I'm better than them. And they missed all their shots. And then I ran away from them because I was like, I'm not trying to mess around with you guys. So I kept on snowboarding. I'm like, I, I knew the objective and I was trying to get that chaos symbol. So I did another flip. And guess what? After that, I did a another flip. And after that, I did a another flip. And that was a super cool flip, by the way. And then, after going around all these cool Christmas trees, we found it, the Chaos Emerald. And guys, I'm just gonna wrap it up for part one. Um, I hope this series doesn't take long because I don't want to keep doing it for super long. Because I'm trying to do this fast. So anyways, bye-bye. But before you go, we got to do our daily verse, which is Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. See you guys later.